Grace and You Cooking Show segment is brought to you by Grace Kennedy Belize Limited, bringing good taste to life. And welcome back. And of course, it's now time for The Kitchen with Grace and you. And joining us today, we have, of course, Trudy, who has been here countless times. And we have Patrick, who is going to cook us up something really special, a seafood delight that will definitely satisfy any palate. Good morning. And Good morning. Uh, thank you for being here. So... Patrick, let's start off. Yeah. What well, he's all about the business. <laughs> he does. Come on, Patrick. We have to know something about you. Our viewers need to know something about you. You don't want to talk. No, no. I, I'm going. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to get this. Uh, no, um, he's all about the business. Yeah, we're going to um, prepare a uh, um, Caribbean lobster using some um, Caribbean. Okay. Yeah, so I just want to put a little bit of the coconut oil in that um, in that pan. Okay. Yeah. Just tell me when. Yeah. You can, a little, a little bit, bit more, more yes, yeah, a little bit more, yeah. I'm going to use it, um, a little bit of the seafood consommé to season our lobster here. Okay. Right. A, little bit of, a little bit of salt. So it's very basic seasoning when very it comes basic. to seafood. Yeah, like you, you don't, don't have to no, marinate it or do anything uh, of that. Want, you don't want to overpower the, um, the taste of the, of the Lob seafood. Uh, uh -huh. right, in this case, we're using some fresh lobster. Okay. All right, so we're going to start with that. That cooking a little bit. Then, then in the other, uh, we could put some some more coconut some, oil. Okay. Grace coconut oil. Um, um, I just also want to mention, William, for those people who um, make sure that they watch the Grace and You cooking show. Our last show we did have lobster, likewise, but we're looking at the fact that one, the lobster season is open, yeah. and so this is the best time to cook it, not when the season is closed. Um, Patrick was telling me this morning, it is important that we take a look at the size of the, the lobster, make sure that it's not um, too small, because again, remember, um, it's for us to be able to enjoy the seafood for many, many more years to come. So last time we had a curry coconut lobster, and so Patrick is doing something different. So remember, it doesn't have to be the same thing, even though it's the same, yeah, exactly. the same yeah, seafood. There's a lot of different ways to, ways yes. to cook lobster, no? Okay, we're gonna just flip these over. And I'm gonna add a little bit of onions to this. Ah, some bell pepper. Also onions or red onions. Yeah, red and white onion. Yeah. Yeah, I love. I'm gonna add a little bit of tomato here. And, and what do you want? Turn what? this one off. I'll turn All it right. off. Yeah. Have good nice nice skills there, Patrick. <laughs> you only do this at home, right? No, no, I, no, no, I don't do that. <laughs> I wish. Yeah. Okay. And I'm gonna um you know open it here to open this beer. Oh my I forgot to open Come on, the <laughs> chefs are I forgot to open it. Uh, a little bit of the car beer here to this lobster. Ah. Alright. Then I'm going to add a little bit of um, garlic powder here, a little bit of the malher garlic powder. Okay. Just a little bit. Just want to give it that. It smells really nice. With it does. Yeah. Yeah. beer, right? And in yeah. the meantime, I'm I like the fact that he has not used a spoon yet. <laughs> let me turn, let me turn. Let me turn it on, and then I'm going to add some, I'm going to do some sauteed potatoes here. Ah, uh, so. I it's pre-boiled yeah, though? Yeah, just pre-boiled, yeah. Okay. Um, so I'm you're just browning it uh, that's right. basically, basically right now? Basically, uh, saute them a little bit with some... Um, right? Yeah, before we have an accident. Okay. Then to the lobster now, I'm going to add a little bit of co um, coconut milk, grace coconut milk that I had pre-mixed pre ahead of time. Okay. And I'm going to add a little bit of tomato sauce here, just a little bit, not much. Just to kind of bring the sauce together. That around a little bit. No, that I can't do, Patrick. I have to cook with spoon and all kind of thing. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, but I'm watching you, you again. I'm, 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 I'm trying to see, you know, how you flick your wrist. See? I get that going there a little bit. <laughs> all right, then um, I'm going to add a little thyme here to the sauce. Okay. A little bit of thyme, a little bit of parsley. All right. So bring this together a little bit here. Add a little salt. Mm -hmm. 
But she cannot talk much at all. He just and I'm going to add a little bit of pepper sauce, some grease pepper sauce here. So add a little spice to the lobster. And again, for those who don't like no, hot pepper sauce, no, then you don't have to. It's just optional. Just, you, can, yes. yeah, you don't have to use any spice yeah. to it. It's, a little, it's nice to put a little spice to the lobster. No? Okay. How long does it take to cook, Patrick? Well, for seafood, not long. This would take about five minutes okay. maximum. You don't want to overcook the seafood because it gets, it gets a little bit tough, you know, okay. a little chewy. Yeah. So I'm going to finish the sauce with a little bit of butter. Right. And butter is u usually for flavor, right? Flavor, that's right. So how come flavor. we didn't add the butter like in the beginning? No, because it's just a, it, it actually brings the sauce together as okay. well. Yeah, yeah. Okay. It, it helps to bring the sauce together. So you don't have to add any flour or any, any um, uh, okay. that stuff, no? Okay. All right, then to the potatoes, I'm going to season with a little bit of the, the chicken consomme. It's a little bit there. So I don't need to add any salt or any other um, seasoning to that. Yeah. That has its salt already. Okay. A little, um, a little parsley there. Nice. And then I'll just finish that with a little butter. Don't burn the butter, William. All right. <laughs> Should I lower it? Yeah. 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 Let yeah. me lower just it a lower bit. The, And then I'm just going to finish the lobster with a little bit of lime. Ah. Right. Right. That'll give you a nice little zing. Zing exactly to the... Right? Bring that down. Now I know you're used to being in the kitchen, you know, William, because you already know that you have enough heat and you can move it from off the stove. <laughs> yeah, you're very good. <laughs> <laughs> um, so is this done as long as the butter melts? Or yeah, do it's we just need a, to yeah, it doesn't need a lot. Just to, to brown the potato because okay. basically the potato is cooked already. So okay. it's just to brown the potato and then um, Perfect. you can basically take that off and then our okay. lobster is good. Our lobster is pretty much finished. All right. Yeah. Great. So this doesn't take a long time to cook. Right? Okay. It's, that's pretty well, much while there. you play it then, Patrick, what I'm going to do is I'm going to be making a beverage here. Um, as we all know, it is Cancer Awareness Month. Um, you guys had so we're going pink? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> um, what we're going to do is we're going to go close enough to pink as we can reach. I decided to do the sorrel, the shandy lime and the shandy sorrel. So we're going to use just half of the bottle here. And this Remember, is an adult. well, the thing is, Shandy contains 1.2% alcohol. So the alcohol content is not such that it will do absolutely anything to anybody. So if it is that you'd like to give just a little to your child, you can go ahead and do that. Not that we're promoting giving alcohol to, to children. But like I said, 1.2%. Um, we offer it to our um, staff at work. You can have it. With lunch, because on the job. again, yes, of course. Ah. That's what we're at Grace Kennedy. It's super <laughs> wonderful, right? I'm coming over today. <laughs> Truly. <laughs> it's only $2, you know, and it's served chill. <laughs> so, um, Patrick and I were talking, and again, that is what um, happens when it is that you're trying to create something. I told him I just want a drink that will come out pink. And so, to that, we're adding the used pina colada, and this is just to add a little bit of fruit flavor. To it, and I just kind of pre mixed it because, of course, you know that already contains its sugar there and pink enough with them. Yeah, so we're just gonna blend that. High. Sounds good. All right, it looks great well, too. I really want you to try it because, um, like I said, we invented this yesterday and we we're just looking at the flavors. So if I don't like it, I spit it back in the glass. That's I'm what going to saying. ask you to pass this over to Patrick, actually. I literally don't like to pour drinks out of the blender. Mm, and it's frothy. Yeah. Here you go, William. Okay, with a pink straw too. <laughs> It's actually very good. It it's very good. Hmm? You're not just telling me that, of course. Of course I would. <laughs> <laughs> it's good. It's really good. Okay, so again, like I said, um, a lot of um, companies are putting up their pink bows and just letting people know um, for Cancer Awareness Month. Um, for the ladies, I say go get tested, and of course for the gentlemen too. And a lot of things, we're waiting for you to plate up, you know, both with them and I are hungry. Oh, cool. <laughs> yeah. um, a lot of things happening at Grace Kennedy, as usual. And we this would be for two, for two people? Yeah, this for you this and I, William. Two people, yeah. I'm just making sure that... Some, you can give Marlene some of yours. <laughs> <laughs> 
So, yeah, I was saying that at Grace Kennedy, we have a new promotion going on, which is for our 100% Colombian coffee. It's a text promotion. Actually, you can go on our website. We will be doing our shopping sprees for the wheelbar promotion that we were doing. And so, um, like I said, anything you'd like to know, you can go on our website, gracekennedybelize.com. Especially for this recipe today, William, we'll have this up by this evening, 3 o'clock. And um, Patrick, I just really want to say it looks super awesome. And you said for two, but... I think we will fight over this. One, <laughs> so much for ladies first. <laughs> <laughs> it looks really, really, wow, really nice. Wow, that looks good. Where's the fork? There's a uh, fork at the back. It looks really, good. really, really great. Patrick. So it's, it's very simple. It's, it's um, Caribbean. Caribbean spice and lobster, yeah. It's done uh, in, that's the only thing great. that has me a little bit worried. It's spicy. Well, like I, like I <laughs> said, you don't have to. Pepper. You can just put, uh, I mean, according to what you can, you know, handle. No, It's just a little, to add a little flavor to the lobster. Lobster is a very, uh, very delicate flavored um, seafood, you know, so you have to know what to put along with it. So, so how do we get to taste other delicacies from Patrick. Patrick? Well, you can come and visit me at my uh, restaurant that I'm opening, and I will be, I'll be making some advertisement very soon. Right? Okay. okay. So, but definitely, um, this is the kind of food I want to offer. No? Wow. All right. Looks All right. really nice. Well, thank you very much, uh, Patrick and Trudy. Thank you, too. And, yeah. um, of course, you ha offered some very good advice to make sure that people go and yes. get their pap smears, yes. their mammograms, yes. etc., and uh, treat yourself well. Of course, we're going to treat ourselves during the break. <laughs> and this has been another segment of Grace and You. And we'll be right back to wrap Open Your Eyes after these messages. and you cooking show segment was brought to you by Grace Kennedy Belize Limited bringing good taste to life looking for quick and easy baking try Grace baking powder it comes in a convenient 10 gram packet Grace baking powder great for my pancakes waffles fry jack flour tortillas muffins waffles wow how quick and easy Grace Baking Powder, so convenient, easy to store, you love it. It's good enough and fresh whenever you need it. Another fine product brought to you by Grace. Recipes, go to gracerecipes.com. It's time for Grace. Grace.